It is stupid comments like this that reminds me that no one knows where money comes from. Occasionally you see my stuff where I'm like, go engineering, choose it, finish it, you can do it. Other things you're seeing, people saying, last month I made $25,000 on social media and here's exactly how I did it. Last year I earned over six figures and I worked one hour a week. You're getting all this nonsense thrown at you and you're wondering, am I wasting my time? Is engineering pointless? Am I a dumbass? for choosing calculus over the Stanley Cup that I could be popping off with on TikTok. And it infuriates me because first of all, let me disabuse you of any notion. I made way more working full-time as an engineer than I ever have as, a, as an influencer. And I work really hard. All the people you're watching on social media who are saying they, they don't work at all and they make a ton of money, it might be true that they don't work as much as a regular full-time job and that they make more before taxes and any business expenses than they could at a regular job. Do they make more than an engineer? Entry level, maybe. But let me tell you about the career prospects for an engineer. It's so steady. It's so reliable. It's so lucrative. <laughs> not only that, but your performance is not evaluated on a day-to-day -day basis. It's on a yearly basis. If you do one great, amazing project for the year, baby, you're set. <laughs> you can breathe easy. You can continue to do great work and not worry about, is this it for me? Am I being shadow banned? Um, why didn't today's performance do as well as yesterday's performance? There's so much anxiety and stress involved with being an influencer. You are on the right path. I want you to realize that no matter what you choose to do with your engineering degree, it will have been well worth it. I want you to stick with it because there are a lot of voices to drown out, but you've got to drown them out because you're doing the right thing. Let me know what you think in the comments.